everyone, my name is Tina and for today's hair tutorial, I'm going to show you how to do a romantic waterfall rope braid half up updo. Since I do like having hair around my face, I'm going to section away my sides and my bangs so that they don't get in the way of my braiding. Take a section at the side about this big, uh, I would say about 2-3 to three inches wide, and then split that in half and start twisting them separately counterclockwise. So take the bottom strand and twist it counterclockwise. Take the top strand, twist it counterclockwise as well, and then bring the bottom strand over the top. So the bottom strand just became the top strand and that was a rope braid. We're going to incorporate strand from the scalp and combine it with the bottom strand and then twist both of them counterclockwise. Twist the top counterclockwise as well. Now before we do the bottom over top again, we're going to do a waterfall here by grabbing some hair from the top and putting it into that hole that I'm pointing out. So we're going to get some hair from the top and stick it into that hole that we made. And when you drop that hair in the hole, we're going to take the bottom strand over top. And that is pretty much what we're going to be doing for the rest of this hair tutorial. So we're going to twist the bottom, twist the top, counterclockwise. And then before we do the bottom over top, we bring some hair from the top and drop it into that hole. And then bring the bottom strand over to the top. And also make sure you are loosening up the rope braids because um, for adults anyway, it looks better. So twist the top counterclockwise gather some hair from the top and drop it into that hole and do the bottom strand over top. And when you reach the back of your head, we're going to just Continue on doing a couple of more regular rope braids before tying it up with an elastic band. And then just repeat the same process on the other side. Combine these two braids into one. You can always wear it like this, but I'm going to show you another way to tie it up. So here is look number two. We're going to make a upside down inverted ponytail with that braid. So we're going to take the ends of our ponytail and stick it under and through the ponytail all the way and then go back and stick some back into the hole. It just really depends on how long your hair is because we want that to kind of drape towards the back. So when the draping looks good enough, look at my hair here, uh, we're going to start pinning it down. This really depends on what kind of hair you have. Um, I use five bobby pins here. You could be using more or less and that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. Please be sure to subscribe, like, and share this video with your friends to see a new hair tutorial every Thursdays and Saturdays. Happy Valentine's Day, everyone. Bye.